Jackie Ungerite says juggling two students in a pandemic is difficult, especially for her second grader Bennett, who started kindergarten as COVID-19 was taking off. His entire academic career has been basically affected by this pandemic. But because of all of this interruptions that we've had over the last two years, they've just not especially my second grader, they just haven't been able to get those dots connected. Ungerite tells me she's grateful the district reached out to the Florida Department of Education. In this letter, Superintendent Addison Davis is asking them to not hold negative standardized test scores against students and their schools overall. And for the, you know, school district to send out this letter acknowledging all of the issues that I've, in my mind, have felt have been going on, like, you know, all of the absences of not just the students, but also of the teachers. Superintendent Davis says 10,000 students and teachers were impacted in the month of January alone by COVID-19. He believes this is their worst pandemic year yet. It, it really is not a, a true reflection of our abilities and skill sets of our, of our learners. And there's a number of barriers. Uh, we just ask for grace and compassion once again during the school year. Ungerite also believes relieving the pressure of standardized testing can help teachers focus on their day-to-day -day lessons.